What's pumping? B Boy Solo of Millionaire Hammer here, and welcome back to Gotta Go Get a Bird right now. So, in the last episode of Skyward Sword, as I totally just said that was the name of, uh, we went up here in this place where the music got silent, and, uh, we successfully got our bird back. Or, no, we didn't, I'm lying. I'm totally lying. No, but we, we found that we couldn't find our bird, we gotta find it now. So, now we can go down here, actually. So we can just drop where we used to be in the first episode. And this door is now open, so we can finally explore the rest of Skyloft. Whee! Alright, so let's just check out. This kid looks like he's failing. He needs our help. Okay, actually, maybe not. Oh, uh, God, the fellow! Hey! Hey, shadow! You can't be accepted! No! I have to give me this shit. Hey! This magic trait. <laughs> oh, this voice kills me. Literally. No, I'm just kidding. It's like having to do this and change the nunchuck when you're right in the of a tree. Bam! You're right in the bed. Okay, sure, fine. So I showed in the last episode you could do a roll. So, boom! <laughs> you did it! Sky State Beetle! Wait up! <laughs> Whatever, kid, you fail. Oh, there we go. Got our first currency in the game. We got a blue rupee with five rupees. Ironically, we found one before we found even a green rupee, which is worth one rupee. But everyone knew that. Uh, so anyway, let's move on. There are heart flowers over here. You got a heart. This side was like giving. Yeah. So yeah, hearts are important. Uh, we actually have a cutscene coming up, so we gotta check over here and uh, check out what's going on. All right, where are these guys? I know who they are. I'm lying. Oh, no, gross. I sure was a pain. What, with all the scratching and pecking? Of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft winner like that was gonna go down with a little fight? Ugh. We got it. I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. Oh, this guy's an ass. He's the one who did it, I'm sure. And get a first person view. Let's see what's pumping. Whoa! It's all it's all in room yeah. So how long you been standing there? Okay, fuck you, man. What's your problem anyway? Oh wait, I got it. You shouldn't talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. Fuck you. They're pleading. Oh gross! Can't you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate. So you could get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the charge at the end of the ceremony. Ugh. Well, sorry, pal. Gross doesn't do clear cheer. Pleh. Cheering for whips. My advice? Work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. You suck. Sir, come to think of it. How come I don't see your bird? Where is that scuffed pile of red first? Don't disgrace my rarity. <laughs> Can't imagine what could have happened to him. Do you think his brain got confused with all the clouds got lost? <laughs> Alright, so got bring it on. Give him back. Nice hair. Alright. <laughs> well, I know it's him, but I can just be like, you know what, fine, I'll just say that. Could say nice hair. <laughs> huh? I've got no idea what you're talking about. You're a lying bitch. You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget about you about Zelda go way back. You friends since you were kids, big deal. It doesn't change the fact that you flow through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and go grow brack brack bone already? No. Dopes like you are dragging around our honor academy through the mud. And just who you might be talking about, Gross? Oh. He's screwed. <laughs> oh, this is Elder. Nah, it's so. Uh. Ugh. Don't even try, Gross. You know you're picking on Solo again, aren't you? Wait, what? He's a student at the academy, like all of us. Yeah. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Yeah, I suppose. 
You suppose? Suppose what? I suppose you were going to go get Forget it. I wasn't supposing anything, okay? Another guy to hate. Okay, we're out of here, boys. Later, Sol. Hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. Oh, these goonies are all like, Oh, we're so cool. Look at that midget on the right. Hey, I'm so cool. <laughs> That could be a major setback towards knighthood, so find that bird. Or get real get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. You know what your special flavor is? Ass! <laughs> ah, you have an ugly whistle too. God. Real ugly. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect those block Wait a minute. Oh dang it! Ah, oh, flick. This block had some something. Okay, so yeah, they had something to do with my lawful disappearance. I wanted to help you find the birds. So we better get searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can see spot any trace of your bird. Thank you, Zelda. You're useful. Father said he'd be he'd be talking to Inspector Hornwell delaying the start of the wing ceremony. So don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. Alright, Zelda's pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, I should stop doing that. <laughs> Seriously. I'm just gonna pause it briefly because I have to do something. So, there's the map. That's when you press the plus button. And I'm just gonna do something really quick. Okay, this should help a, this should help a bit with the uh, volume. Hopefully, hopefully it's not... Uh, super effective, but I mean, I mean, hopefully it's a little more. Actually, I'll turn it down a slight bit. Ah, uh, dang it. Alright, this is good, I think. Alright, so let's move on. Uh, we should go back and find our bird, but to do that, we gotta go somewhere. We have to go back to the Night Academy, and then check that place out. Get some more stamina fruit, run around this place. Well, this place like there's no one, to, nothing to do. Uh, come on. This is very annoying. Hey, the door's open now, sweet. So now we can get there a lot faster, which is very useful. Uh, no, I don't want to go there. Sorry. I actually want to go down here. Hey, solo. Over here. I'm gonna give him a British accent. I have some information about your left wing. Come over here. Oh, sure. Parkour! Whoa! <laughs> Sad. I'm just joshing you. Oh, cutscene. Hey, Solo. I was just looking for you. I heard about your lost wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this one out has flinch what he knew. He started acting weird. Hey. I'm so sorry, so well, I really wanted to tell you, but if Chris found out I told you. Sounds like Kirps has forced him to keep quiet about it. No shit, you're, you're Captain Obvious Pivot. Go on, tell him the truth. Just a little while ago when I was cleaning the dining hall, Bruce and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your watchwing. I wanted to warn you some, but it was just a sick way. Bruce and his gang appeared and grabbed me. Said that if they told you, they would make sure I'd never be able to ride a bird ever again. Sounds like Rips and his buddies have a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. A waterfall. A waterfall. Well, near a waterfall with me. Quick, let's take a look at your map. I know what my map is. I just showed that. That's right. Over there. I think it means the waterfall marked here with X. And uh, that would be, uh, hold on a second. That would, no. Right here, I think, would be the X that he is talking about. You know how to read a map, right? Just press plus at any time to see a map of the area. He gets lost, just plus. Alright, thank you. Give me the I could not being such a coward. I'm really sorry. Yeah, sorry. Alright, so next thing we gotta do is actually go in here. Gotta get something important. So over here is the sparring area, and we can do a whole bunch of stuff. 
this guy. Er, where's it solo? So you still want to get some sword practice even though the day's the wing ceremony. I'm impressed. The sword is in the back room. Go ahead and get it. I'll be here for a while, so certainly understand about height. Handling the sword, go ahead and ask. Alright then. So there's a sword back here, and we're gonna get that sword. Be our first sword of the game, yay! See this treasure chest? You wanna press A to open it, cause that's how you open a treasure chest. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that. But yeah. Do -do 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 we finally got a our first wep er, first weapon in the game. It's a practice sword. Students at the Nine Academy practice with these. Looks like it has a fairly sharp blade. Press one at any time to look at the items that you're carrying. So now we get it on our back, and to use it, all we have to do is swing our rear mount like so. Whatcha? Yes, now we have a sword. Sweet. So let's just get some practice in. I'll show you guys how to use this. So this is where you want to stab, poke that to stab. You want to go like diagonal. Sorry. There you go, diagonal strike. And then another diagonal to strike. This is for shield, so I can't use that. This is a vertical slash and a horizontal slash. That's right, Solo. He's a really strong swordsman. Easy to teach, too. Are you ready to try to spin? Oh, spin attack. That's a cool move, so. Kind of an ever famous Link move. <laughs> right, now I'm going to surround you with blocks. You need to cut them all without moving from that spot. All you have to do is swing the way remote and then chuck horizontally at the same time. Not too hard. Give it a shot. Whoa, where did all these come from? Anyway, ready? <laughs> nice. I did it. I sure looked like it felt good. So why don't you try a fiddle blow to close our session? Sure. Alright, when your enemy is down, target it with Z and swing the rear remote in the nunchuck at the same time they'll land a fatal blow. Do a side slash on that log. When it's down, try finishing it off with this technique. Alright, here we go. So you gotta side slash and then see that thing? Fatal blow! <laughs> That's my favorite move in the entire game. That's the way! Fatal Blow is also an effective move right after you used your shield or a well placed spin attack to knock it off the enemy on its back. Oh, but the monsters don't stay down for long, so you have to swing the Wii Remote and the Nunchuck quickly before they get back on their feet. That's gonna be a very important thing later in the game, so let's just get out of here. Oh, I. Hey, Solo. You can't take swords outside the sparring hall. What do you think you're doing sneaking out with that? Dude, I have an issue. What? The loft wing is missing? You want to go look for it? Well, I guess I can make an exception just this once, but remember, Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. So I don't want to see you swinging it around crazy out there. I don't want to get in a ton of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get in plenty of practice on these logs first, and once you get outside with that sword, only use it when you absolutely have to. Got it? Alright, I have enough practice already, so I think I'm good. Let's just get out of here. All right, and we're out. Let's just uh, let's explore some more. Explore some more, some more, some more horrors. Horse? Yeah. I don't know. I don't even know. All right, so we're moving on with a sword. Oh, check this out. What is this thing coming out of the ground? So she goes down. Boing. <laughs> I love the boing. Hey, friend, walk yourself over here. Say hello. I just automatically walk. How do you do? I'm what you call a sheet shaker stone. Glad to meet you. I'm a stone a few words, so I'll get right to it. You're going to find yourself in puzzling circumstances as you make your way through this world. If you should find yourself stuck and have no idea how to move forward, come see me. I've got nothing for you right now, but come down the road when you're feeling stuck. The things I will show you may just come on the right track. Go back up there, friend. Thank you, sir, but I don't need anything right now. I guess I just gotta move on life. See, this is what happens when you run out of stamina. You get really tired and just start like walking around really lame. So anyway, just want to monitor your stamina when you can. Uh, there's a balcony where you can jump off with your bird once you've gotten it later in the game. There's annoying kid. That's stamina fruit. And I'm just doing some really boring commentary. So I think I'll end it off in this episode. So thanks for watching guys. Actually, I think I'll get to her. I want to go, and then I'll stop it, so, uh, there's some people over here, I'll come back, I mean, they're, they're not really important to the story at all, so I'm not gonna, like, talk to them, there's a girl we'll see in a side quest later, uh, I will talk to her eventually, but, uh, 
you want to go right here and see this lake. You want to jump on these pads as so, just to run across. Whoops. Whoop. 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 And we want to go into that cave. And that's why we're going to need our sword. So, thanks for watching, guys. Next time on uh, Skyward Sword, we will get in that cave and see if we can find our lost wing there. And also cut up some trees. So, like, comment, subscribe if you know the drill. And, uh, B-Boy Solo out. Yeah. Okay, I can't stop it now because I can't find my cursor. There it is. There it is. Alright. See ya.